With all of the craziness that has been surrounding the Star Citizen community lately, I want to toss something positive into the cauldron. Today, we are going to talk about what kind of Star Citizen content I want to make, when so many content creators out there do such a good job already covering just about everything you want to know. I don't want to simply regurgitate content, so I have some ideas how I would like to create my own unique content. I feel like the Star Citizen community deserves new content, and I'm going to go ahead and say this. I think a lot of the current content creators are burnt out. Also, TLDR, I think that there is still space for me to be creative and provide valuable content. It just took me a while to have the time to get started. Make sure to watch all the way through this video. Today I will be announcing the first channel giveaway. Don't play Star Citizen and watch my channel for other content? Don't worry, this giveaway is for you too. This is my first video that I have ever made exclusively geared towards Star Citizen, for my own reasons. Before we get into any of that, let's talk about what I want to cover concerning Star Citizen. I want to create content that focuses on solo gameplay and techniques. Solo gameplay that isn't focused on combat, that's already covered quite well on YouTube. What I am passionate about is industrial, economic, min-maxing, and base building. I am the kind of person that likes to think to myself, if you are taking fire, you already failed your mission. In Star Citizen, people complain about griefing, getting stream sniped, all that, but let me tell you, if you know your current gameplay loops well, you are very efficient, almost robotic. I have not been shot down since before Loreville dropped. So, I want to create content that is focused on solo players. Why solo players? Well, because I play solo. Whether or not you are in an org, my goal with my content is to still provide value to you. And no, I'm not trying to shut out anyone, or shun anything, or invoke the wrath of a passionate community of which I shall refrain from naming. I have been in orgs in many games, I've run orgs that lasted 5 or even 10 years, but with Star Citizen, I find myself playing solo, due to life. I've been told many times that you can't be successful solo in Star Citizen, or you need to be in an org to get maximum enjoyment out of it. I have been in SC orgs, and let's just say that not everyone gets the effort out that they put in. I believe, very passionately, that you can play this game solo, do what you want, when you want, and still be successful. I want to make content showing how I do that. The content I make will be positive and follow some specific criteria. First, activities should require more brain than pew pew. Content should be specific on whether it is targeted toward current or future gameplay. No drama, shilling, or arguing about the state of the project. I will only contribute positive content. Period. The Fried Industry or TFI's gaming channel content is focused on small-scale industry or SSI, which includes trading, base building, crafting, automation, etc. Any tips that I give will be focused solely on in-game grinding. I won't ever tell you how you should spend money on Star Citizen outside of in-game currency. Plenty of Star Citizen creators already covered that. So, how about we start with a giveaway? Let's talk about the giveaway before we dive too much further. It took a long time for me to get the channel set up to where I could even try a giveaway, but I always knew that I wanted to do what I can to share my passion for gaming. And that always meant that giveaways would be a part of the community I wanted to help build. I am not a large channel. I am very small, actually. I am doing this with my own funds. I'm not monetized or sponsored or affiliated with or sponsored by YouTube or anything like that. The first giveaway is small, but should be a nice little surprise for anyone's day who wins. Here are the giveaway rules, which will also be in the description of the video below. Win your choice of a Star Citizen Consolidated Outland Hover Quad LTI token, valued at $25, a $25 Steam gift card, or, if you choose, a $25 PayPal gift. There will be one winner for the giveaway and they can select one of the three options I just listed. Here are the official rules, please bear with me. You and the TFI Gaming Channel will adhere to the YouTube Community Guidelines. Entries that do not comply with the Community Guidelines or the rules of this contest will be disqualified. The giveaway is free to enter. Comment on any video between now and the end of the giveaway. Make sure it is not a lazy or inappropriate comment, it will be disqualified. 
The winner's comment will be featured in a future video and announced on the Fried Industries Reddit page. Once the channel has reached 50 subscribers, the giveaway entry window will close and a winner will be selected within 24 hours. The winner will then need to contact the Fried Industry directly at thefriedindustry at gmail.com. This email address will always be located on the About section of my YouTube channel as well. Simply click on the contact link located there. When the winner sends the email, specify the one prize you select to receive and the appropriate email address that should receive that prize. You will then be instructed in an email reply as soon as humanly possible with an instruction to prove that you are the legitimate winner. The full list of official rules will be in this video's description and a link to the rules will be posted on the Fried Industries Reddit page, which is in every video description and on the channel's about page here on YouTube. I plan to do more with giveaways in the future, but I want to contribute how I can to those who appreciate my content. So if you choose the LTI Star Citizen Prize, the Hover Quad, the $25 Steam gift card, or $25 PayPal gift, my hope is to brighten your day. A surprise gift is always nice, and I want to show you that I am sincere about the content I intend to make. So let's get a little more informal now, for those of you who are still here. Thank you for sticking around. How Star Citizen is played, and how I want to play. The answer to this is quite simple. Starting with how I have played Star Citizen, I got burnt out, to be blunt. Not with Star Citizen as a whole, but years of sinking my time into the community, the website, being a guide, running orgs, being in orgs, drama, it goes on. To get more specific, I realized at one point that I had spent so much time with Star Citizen that I decided one day a few years back to replace the free time I spent following just one project with learning new skills and playing other games I loved again. I still play SC, but not exclusively. I still keep up with the news, but I do it because of the content creators, not the current drama on the web, and not for Cloud Imperium games. I play Star Citizen as an industrialist, and mostly solo because this game just isn't there yet for a lot of folks. Even in large orgs I have been in, there are usually only a small handful of daily players, even less of them is interested in what I'm interested in. They appreciate what I'm into, but I usually just end up funding ship purchases like hammerheads or something. I wanted more. I don't want to be forced to be a turret gunner, and I don't want to be expected to put in all of the work and the funds for said hammerhead. Anyhow, my proposed content will be focused on things you can do solo, if you are a one citizen wolfpack for that play session. Things like min-maxing, trading, salvage, cargo hauling, building your fleet or hangar, meta trade routes, etc. When you do meet up with other friends or org mates, that's cool. They'll appreciate how effective you are at your industry or industries, logistics, all the more brain than pew pew stuff we talked about. This is my playstyle, and I have a hangar roster to match that role. Base building, salvage, crafting, overclocking, selling exotic goods, that's what my dream hangar roster is for, and I can't wait to have all of the game's professions to do something different each day. That small scale industry life. Most of us that have played Star Citizen for more than a few days understand how the game is played, so let's get to how I want to play. I always find myself in a loop of playing, contributing, reporting bugs, and ultimately working my butt off for free. I think, oh well, they are only wiping every so often now, or now they have finally done something about 30k crash recovery, now is the time to keep on going. Even still, I want more. The game mechanics and experience I want and dream of simply aren't available yet. And that's okay. I still play all the time, just not as much as I would like to. Cool. I have plenty of other sci-fi and space games to keep me sharp in the meantime, and the rest of that time can go to making content for you and experiencing the development process. I'm sure I'm going to get hammered on this and be told I don't understand game development for whatever reason. Yeah, that's what everyone has been saying for years, but you won't ever hear that from me. Let me say this. I love the idea of Star Citizen. I love the project, and I have followed the game's development daily for the better part of a decade, and regularly since its inception. I will be there when it and as it becomes more of a reality. I will still follow the content creators closely. But, this video is mainly for those who are looking to do something else with the majority of their time, regardless of the reason, to enable them to continue loving Star Citizen and following the project as they want to, and learn to enjoy the game even when they are the only one online, and maybe receive a tip or trick from my content that enhances their gaming experience positively. 
This video and any Star Citizen content that I ever make is not intended for org recruitment or drama or to tell you to get friends to play the game, etc. Please, do not come here for the typical white knighting, you don't understand, you got scammed, etc. I've seen it for years, seen both sides of the fence. You won't get any traction on that here, that's not what we're about. Whatever your reason may be, you may not have the time to be in a supposedly hardcore organization either, or have dozens of friends that play Star Citizen regularly. If you want to maximize your time and fun that you have with Star Citizen, even while solo, whether it's an hour or six hours, that's the content I am proposing. That's it. Reasoning over. I am still very positive about Star Citizen, the project, the community, and what the future holds. And also, if there are those in the community that want to play something else, hopefully I can get them to look for enjoyment in other games they have not considered yet. For example, I'm currently creating a playlist for the game Satisfactory, which is focused on modular building, efficiency, and organic expansion for this playthrough. And so, that does it for today's video. If you liked today's video and would like to see more, be sure to check out my videos for something else on my channel that may pique your interest. If you would like to see more Star Citizen content that I proposed, you will definitely find more content in your niche here soon. And check out the link on the top of the screen right now to see how I get my small scale industry on in other games. More is on the way. I need your help to create a community that showcases what time, patience, and a little bit of creativity, industrialism, and automation can produce, both for gaming entertainment and for brain food. Star Citizen, Space Sims, Automation, and the base building genres deserve it. Lastly, if you made it this far in the video and you liked my content, please leave a like, subscribe if you think I earned it, and share this video with friends. The content is going to keep coming either way, but I sure would like to reach more people with positive content. It really is that simple. Oh, and please check out my Reddit page, The Fried Industry. That's where I'm posting the latest info on upcoming stuff for the time being. Also, don't forget the official rules for the giveaway will be there too. All links will always be in the description of every video. The Fried Industry needs you. Stay fresh, stay effective, and stay you.